if I can relive five minutes of my life. That is a good question. Five minutes back on the spot. That's a really hard question. Time I spent like worrying about graduating on time and then it happened, so like just time spent like worrying about the future. Um, probably spend five minutes with my brother. Uh, he passed away when I was little, so to be able to have five minutes with him just to, I don't know, catch up, see how he is, be nice. Oh dear. Oh, just to go back to England. Five minutes to go redo that again. I would do that in a heartbeat. Saying I do to my wife. When I was playing soccer in high school, first thing that comes to mind would be the five minutes when I wrecked my first car. I was speeding down a gravel road and I lost control. I would get those five minutes back because then I would still have that nice Nissan. <laughs> when I was in Rome, there was like a Romanian homeless person playing like a beautiful song at sunset on a bridge right outside of like outside of a castle, so kind of by San Pietro Square. That five minutes was pretty great. I would get that five minutes back for sure. Probably just like all the times I just take naps and I can do something else. I don't know. I would say probably when we went on a family vacation when I was little to Florida with my entire family and we were all hanging out. That was like the only time we ever went on a vacation together. So I would say either that or to be sadder when my grandmother was dying. I'd say one of those two. Just spending a little more time with her. So. I'll probably start crying if I start saying it, but uh, there was this one five minutes where my grandpa and I used to um, like raise monarchs every year and then let them out to his garden so they continuously like come back every year and then I see them everywhere. But if there was, if I could give that five minutes, letting them go with him, I think I would take it back. I was talking about a rehearsal dinner that my grandmother helped me with and I think I wasn't very grateful at one point with the dinner talking about it and it upset her and she left in kind of a rush and later on I knew we sort of made up and it was okay but if I had five minutes back I would have behaved differently in that moment and done anything I could to keep her happy. Um, so I think the five minutes that I would like to relive of my life are the last five minutes that I spent with my cousin um, about six years ago now I think it is he committed suicide um, so I think it'd just be really, I think I would have spent those last five minutes very differently with him knowing that they were going to be the last five minutes that I had with him. Um, well, I'm from Minnesota and I played hockey my entire life. And then my junior year I found out I have a back disease so I had to quit. And that was like the most devastating thing ever. So if I could get back five minutes it would probably be on the ice. <laughs> say that there's one moment that I had that was like really far back in the past. It was me being a kid and like looking up at the stars, but it was like one of those like forbidden times that I wasn't supposed to like actually be awake. And I don't know, I think that was, like the sun of course came up and so all the stars like went away. And I think that would probably be like, if only I could have had like five more minutes of memory. Like it's all up, like it's a glimpse of time now. So it's held in my mind, but yeah. I'm probably like those life changing moments with friends and stuff, you know, where you really like, Learn something that you don't know before, like learning moments. Probably not one in particular, just something where I can like, a five minute altercation with someone that I haven't met, where I learn something about either myself or them that is really just like progressive and just some, like, probably this, something like this. This would be one of those five minute moments. You know, I've, I've gone through uh, cancer where I had to sign my life over to a funeral home. I've gone through bankruptcy, divorce, and homelessness. and. And honestly, I think it's shaped who I am today. So I don't know if I'd go back and give and, and redo five minutes. Um, but if I could, I would take that five minutes and give it to somebody else who may not have um, had a desirable life that they wanted or um, came out with the outcomes that they wanted and maybe give them my five minutes.